Thank you, Jen. At the tail end of the president's remarks today about cybersecurity, he was asked about Afghanistan, and he made a joke. I think joke. Peter asked him that question. The other Peter did, and he made a joke. So what's so funny? Well, I think the question he was asked, if I remember correctly, was about uh, when he will provide information about a decision on August 31st. I don't want to paraphrase the question if that was an inaccurate description of the question. To a lot of people watch. Of course, it's a very important question, and I think what he conveyed, uh, what is that. Um, he has not, well, what I can convey from here, I should say, is that uh, as he stated yesterday, and as the Secretary of State just stated, we're on track to complete our mission by August 31st. Obviously, there are discussions, uh, and the President received a briefing just this morning. Uh, as I noted, he asked yesterday for contingency plans, and he received a briefing on them this morning. These are incredibly serious issues, and they are discussions that are happening internally. And I'd note that um, in addition to the contingency uh, plans that he, uh, he requested, he also, I will reiterate, as, as we stated yesterday, that this is all contingent on us achieving our objectives and, our continue, and the continued coordination with the Taliban. And the President has spoken, I would say, to this issue. Peter, as you know, you've been attended a number of these multiple times over the last several days. Um, and he has also uh, highlighted the fact that we are closely watching, closely following uh, the threats from ISIS-K, which he also received a briefing on this morning. And his remarks last night, he gave a lot of time to the domestic agenda. Does he think that the Build Back Better plan is as urgent and as time sensitive as this evacuation of Americans and Afghan friendlies from Kabul? Well, first of all, uh, I think it's important to the American people who care deeply about whether they're going to have jobs, whether they're uh, going to have child care, uh, whether they are going, whether we are going to be able to compete uh, with China and countries around the world, to understand that we have to do multiple things at the same time. That's okay. exactly what any president of the United States has to and do. The next one, just as these negotiations about safe passage for Americans and mm -hmm. SIV holders continue, why haven't we heard the president say? The United States does not negotiate with terrorists. Is that still the U.S. policy? Well, of course it is, Peter, but I would also say that uh, there's a reality that the Taliban is currently controlling large swaths of Afghanistan. Uh, that is a reality on the ground. And right now our focus and our priority is getting American citizens evacuated and our Afghan partners evacuated. And I would say, given the numbers that we've outlined and briefed for you, uh, that we've had made a great deal of progress in doing exactly that. 